welcome to a new video so in this video we are going to discuss if you are installed uh, the visual studio 2022 so you can find that the asp.net web template or asp.net mbc template is missing by default so yesterday i have installed and i also i found that uh, there is a missing of asp.net uh, framework that i want to create a new project you can see that i am choosing a csop and uh, the choosing as web application but i can't find the sp.net uh, applications or sp.net mbc applications uh, to create a new template project so you can see that everything is uh, coming as the .NET core or blazer but there is a missing of sp.net uh, web template or sp.net mbc template uh, to creation of the project so to get rid of this so i have a quick around solution so the, you can follow that and you can find the solution for that so first we need to go to the visual studio installer for that and uh, we need to install the package uh, and by default the package is not installed by uh, visual studio community so uh, we need to uh, modify that and we need to add the package so visual studio is a community 2022 i have installed so go through that and click on the modify and you can see that asp.net on the web development i have already checked and it suggests that asp.net core asp.net uh, template we can create but it is uh, still missing let's go to the individual components and uh, we can install the individual components so that we can get that so you can say that the dot net from our 4.8 targeting pack is missing so we need to click that and also dot net for project item templates so this thing is very important dot net framework project and item templates so due to this uh, the template was missing and it needed some space to install the software so let's uh, click on the modify and click yes so it should be download uh, the visual studio community of the dot net framework 4.8 and install in our system so it takes some time uh, to install in our system and uh, we can use the template so let's wait for a while So now we can see that the package has been installed so let's flip to the visual studio create a new project and uh, here we can see that the sp.net web application dotnet framework is now present so whenever i click that and I click the next let's create it now we can find that the waveforms mbc web API, all are present of dotnet framework so you can easily do the build according to your requirement so that's it in the video i hope it will help uh, if you are installed on visual studio 2022 so this is a quick around solution of missing dotnet framework templates that's it guys see you on the next video thanks for watching